STMS dress code policy. Tops. Tops may not reveal cleavage and must cover to the waist. Exposed backs, shoulders, and midriff are not permitted. Any top that is skin tight or allows the stomach, cleavage, or undergarments to be exposed is not permitted. Jacket slash coats. It is not acceptable to wear winter coats in school. Hooded tops jackets are acceptable, but wearing the hood inside is not, and it gets hot. Headwear. Hats, bandanas, sunglasses, and visors are not permitted unless medical, uh, unless medical necessary or for religious reasons. Jeans and slash pants. Jeans and pants with rips slash tears are acceptable as long as rips slash tears are located at, at or below the knee. Rips and tears above the knee are acceptable only if skin is not visible. Pants and shorts must be worn above the hip. Undergarments and buttocks must be covered. Tearaway pants, snap pants are not permitted. Pajama pants and tops are not permitted. Yoga pants, jeggings, and leggings are acceptable, however, they cannot be a cheer or see through, and the buttocks must be covered. Footwear. Flip-flops and high heel shoes, heels greater than one inch, are not acceptable for K-5 students. Shoelaces must be tied, shoes must be worn at all times, and slip slippers are not permitted. Shoes, shorts slash shirts slash dresses. Boxer shorts worn as outwear are not permitted. Shorts, skirts, and rompers should be no shorter than three inches above the top of the knee when standing. Cut off pants or shorts are not per are permitted as long as they are the appropriate length. So why do we need a dress code? Well, well, for preparation and respect. The purpose of the dress code is to prepare for the future that we're coming to. Whatever your career path may choose, you will always need to uphold the chance or scene of a professionalism way. Keeping a level of respect for the school and learning environment is best for everyone learning spirit.